are special, we are awesome, we are family. We're full of love, we're full of life, we're a special, awesome family. We're a special, awesome family. It's our special, awesome family. Awesome. Good Friday morning, everybody. I'm getting all my stuff ready for the day. Or at least attempting to. It's been kind of a rough morning. Got a lot going on this morning. Um, Daniel didn't think like we want to get up out of bed, but he's up. And I'm making blends that we need to make for Elon and stuff like that. And a couple other kids that need uh, blends and things. So we're doing that. Morning, Daniel. Good morning. So it's hard to get Daniel out of bed. He doesn't want to get up sometimes. <laughs> but he does eventually get up. <clears throat> oh, so it's Friday. It's Friday, Friday, Friday. Oh, trying to get myself motivated into getting up and moving this morning it's not easy you guys it is not easy it's hard my brain just feels like Ugh. <laughs> like a bunch of gook anyway that's okay make it through it right make it through it make it through it <laughs> anyway Lindsay is off to work he had to go to do some computers this morning and then he had to go set up some PCs this morning for a company, and then he has to go into the station and work for four hours there. He doesn't get off till 8 o'clock tonight. Oh, it's probably nine. So it was just me with the kids today. You guys, it is officially getting cooler here in Texas, but I'm glad of that. It's actually getting cooler. It's November the, what's it? 3rd of November today, I think. Yeah, Friday. So, you guys, I'm so excited about it being November now because it's closer to Christmas, which means I, I don't know whether you guys were around last year, but I did Vlogmas last year. I'm going to do it this year too. Yes, I am. Um, we decorated a little later than we should have last year. But this year, we are decorating good. Yes, Daniel, was that good? Was that tasty? <laughs> We're decorating early this year, you guys, because I want to get the tree up. I want to get everything going and get this tree up and ready to go before Christmas. So I can start heaping it, piling it with stuff. Because when we get back from England, we're going to have a lot of stuff to pile underneath that tree. So we um, did get things ready for the kids' passports this morning. I did go do that this morning before I even came back I had to do breakfast and lunches. I found that first thing. So... Yay, that's done. So we got all the, the kids' pictures and things like that, and which is good. I'm glad we got all that done. So now we're just waiting to get all the passports done. Um, my laundry's are already done. We already have ours, and we're trying to start a DD. Which Rich is a traveler. He travels a lot. So when he does have to, he does already have one. So, yay. <laughs> so, yeah. Um... Oh, yeah, yeah. Just trying to get this morning going. <clears throat> Daniel's already in his wheelchair. He didn't want to really get out of his PJs this morning, though, because he was still kind of in a PJ mood. Oh, hush. Anyway, let's go reminder about the medications. I have to restock meds today. Oh, my God. I don't, I don't even want to think about it. I <laughs> tried it. It takes me forever to do all the meds because there's so much we our kids take and we take that um, we have to stop all that and it takes forever. So let's do that here in a minute. We'll take care of that. Okay. So the feeds are ready. Jonathan's feed is ready. Pierre's feed's ready. Elon's feed's ready. <coughs> Excuse me. And now we're gonna prepare lunches.
Josh just got up. Morning, Josh. So now we're starting to do our lunches. So for breakfast this morning, I was just like, I went really easy. I did French toast sticks and sausage because it was just easy and, you know, just fixed it quickly. So I did that. That way, lunch is going to have his breakfast before he left or go to work. We know that. Um, so yeah. Our daughter Temper's has gotten into fluff now, so that's what she likes for a sandwich. I'm like, <laughs> I can't stand the, the smell or the taste of it, but Tim loves it, so I'm gonna make it for Tempe. Yes, we call her Tempe sometimes. Tempe Champs. So yeah. Um. <clears throat> so we got a call this morning, really early at about 5 a.m. Um. Jewel called and said, you know, sorry to wake you, but we have an emergency case that really needs family. Um, he has nobody. He's never had anyone. He's been in a hospital his whole life until recently. And he was in a family and they they couldn't deal with the medical expense. So they left him at a place and his name is Shannon. He is 17. He'll be 18 in December. Or no, January. Sorry. Um... <coughs> And by Suzanne, they can't keep him. They would be just sending him to a group home, like an institutional group home. And no. So, um, I've got to go pick him up in a little bit as well. After get the kids off, all off to school. Hopefully, we have a good day with the kids as far as school goes. Oh goodness. So, there's Tibby's fluff. And also, his brother Skip is coming as well. His brother Skip is 14, uh, 13. And they both have a rare condition called tubular myopathy. Or, uh, it's a, <clears throat> like, sort of almost like a muscular dystrophy type condition. Um, so he has that. They both have that. Shannon has a more severe case. Skip's is not as bad right now, but he does have a lot of complex medical needs. Yeah. You will know if we will take the complex medical kids. We always have, always will. <laughs> so that's the way it goes. So yeah, um, we got our fifth generation yeah. adult set up yesterday. I'm so excited about that because it's so much better than the third gen ever was. And I have the fourth gen in the bedroom. Look at you know here, and it's just nice. <coughs> so yeah, glad that. <coughs> So we're just going to get things ready this morning. We have the kids off to school and all that. Daniel said he wants a tuna fish sandwich like his daddy. So we're going to make him a tuna fish sandwich. And put it on the same bread lines he likes. Now, because we're trying to cut back on carbs, we've had to cut back on certain kinds of breads we use because of the carbs. <coughs> so, yeah. these sandwiches up and because I'm lazy I'm gonna go ahead and use the buck bags today because I just don't feel like doing to wash all the Tupperware stuff so to use the buck bags because I'm just lazy that way so I've also got to take the, take the puppy for a walk in a little bit um if Rich doesn't do it which he actually I think he has headed out to do that so That'd be good. Um, so, Narkees has been wanting a puppy to train as a service dog. Well, we found one. He's been wanting a pug because he loves doing pug seal. And we found a pug beagle mix, a puggle. So, we're going to get it. And he's already had some training and therapy work and stuff like that. So he already passed the Puppy Stars class and a couple other classes. So we're going to go get him. His name is Buster. <laughs> so we're going to go get Buster today. That was Marquise's last birthday party he wanted was a, a, a puppy. So he is going to get his puppy. Oh, dang, breathing problems again. 
his lunch, get the kids' lunch is ready. Bodhi watched his ketchup with the lolly sandwich again. Kyle is now into, uh, uh, oh god, what is that stuff over here? Um, oh gosh, uh, prevent cheese. I had to think. Uh, guys, I'm not with it, okay? I'm still in my robe, y'all. I'm still, I'll, put, I'll open my PJs in my robe. Alright. <laughs> I'm lazy about changing right now. I know I have to because I have to go pick up Shannon and Skeppy and also go pick up Narcus's puppy. So, sorry we're like getting the puppy, but um, we had to wait for a few more training classes to go through for him to be able to get the puppy. So, he's just gonna go with me. He's gonna take the day off and go with me. Get up his get pick up his puppy. So, I'm excited about that. <laughs> Chips and yogurts. Look at the chips in a minute. I'm doing their yogurts now. Um, drinks. So he wants juicy juice. Others want water, Mondo's. Kyle wants his chocolate milk. Bodie wants milk. <clears throat> Daniel wants his Fiji water. I already put a bottle of water in Lonzi's lunch. I'll take him his lunch, though. He probably, I don't think he picked it up. Okay, guys, we are getting these lunches ready to go. Yogurt. <laughs> Lonzi's Snickers yogurt for him, which well, yeah, is what Daniel likes, too. Daniel's. Bodie's. Josh's. Alex's, Chase, uh, J J James's, I can't, really, Rocky, <clears throat> Shannon's, Skippy's, they go to the special needs, they'll be going to the special needs school too, oh my goodness, you guys, our lives are crazy right now, ranch packets, And spoons for the yogurts. I also put an apple because the kids love apples and I flashed it up real good for them to have. So, yeah. Okay, chips for everybody. Alright, Lonzi, Kyle, Bodie, Skippy, Shannon. Josh, Alex, Asa, <clears throat> oh, almost put one in Elon's, oh no, Rocky, really, you are crazy, <coughs> Jonathan's bag, there's Jonathan's bag, So we're trying to do everything we can to get the things ready to go because it's time. It's we're it's go time. I'm gonna say it, it's total go time. So try to get everything ready to go because it's crunch time now. The ABA kids, ABA kids are about to leave. Ezra, honey, here's your lunchbox, my love. I'm ready to go for you, okay? I got your Kool-Aid burst in the other way. You like it, okay? Ezra loves Kool-Aid bursts. I don't know why. I like them too. <clears throat> Put your eyes back in, okay? Oh, why are you whining, Henry? You want to go outside too? We'll go outside a minute, okay? I'll well, get the kids outside on the bus. Napkins, it says Lovekins on it. Some of these say I love you on them. Narcus has uh, his name on it, his birthday hat. <laughs> this is a leftover from his birthday, so. <sighs> okay, serious crunch time. So the ABA kids just left, so we're gonna get ready to get our other kids on the buses. Um, Lane and Dana are getting ready to go. Josh and Alex already 
up doing homeschool. All right, guys, let's go for it. Okay, guys, we're getting ready to go. Getting ready to meet the bus for our special needs kids. There it is. Are you excited? Ewan's excited. Daniel's excited. Steven is excited, aren't you, Steven? Come on. Go, go, go. Go, Daniel, go. I love this new wheelchair for him. Look, it's fast. He loves it. Good job. This is Alberto. You can load the kids up in their wheelchairs and the bus. Um, <clears throat> make sure Steven stays in his convict stroller and spout it that way. It keeps him happy. Okay. So he's loading them up. You guys have an amazing day, okay? Tell mommy all about it when you get home. When you get home, it'll be a long weekend, okay? Be a good weekend, all right? Okay, good job, Dan. Daniel's moving himself now because he has an electric wheelchair. He, he can do a, Daniel, a manual too, but which he does have one. But the electric one is more feasible, especially for school, because he can't get around as well in the manual for school. <clears throat> You guys have a really awesome day, okay? When you get home, you get to see the new puppy. We're gonna have a good dinner tonight. And we're gonna go do some stuff tomorrow, probably. Go do some Christmas shopping, right, Daniel? Yeah. Mom, what, Dad? Um, I wanna shop for another buddy because that way my baby boy has a friend. You do, Kyle? I mean, uh, Steven? Yes. What do you want, Daniel? I want the same thing. I want to shop for another buddy for my little guy because that way he has a friend. Well, we'll do that there, okay? Can we get them Christmas gifts too? Yeah, Mom, can we? Yes, you can. Okay, sweeties. You guys have an amazing day, okay? Mom will be right here waiting for you. So I was going to just load them on, help load them because it takes time to load everybody. We've got a big family, so. Love you guys. Bye. They're gone. My oh, babies are gone. <laughs> They're gone. <sighs> well, let's go get ready to go get Keys' puppy. <laughs> hey guys, we're heading to get pick up Narkees' <clears throat> puppy. He is with me. He's actually driving us there. Right, Narkees? Yep. I'm driving this time because I want to see the puppy. Yeah, you want to see the puppy? Yes, I want to see the puppy. So we're using my mom van because he likes my mom van. <coughs> <coughs> so we're going to head over to get the puppy. So um, I got a call from Jennifer's teacher saying that Jennifer was kind of fussy and laying down a lot and just not very happy. Um, I told her I said give her um, her Tylenol and give her some juice, see if that helps. Um, I don't know if it has helped yet. She doesn't call back. Aurora's doing great though. Aurora's doing awesome. Hmm. Other kids are doing awesome too. <coughs> so I don't know if I'll have to go pick her up or not. I hope I don't because I have a lot I have to do today. I'm going to go pick up the puppy and take them and keys home and I've also got to go get some decorations because we're doing the Christmas tree tonight. At least I think we are. I don't know. It's for now. Baby feels. Might have to do it before he gets home because he'll be tired and not want to do much so. Yeah. Anyway. So we're going to go get the puppy. Narkees has wanted this particular type of puppy for the longest time. And I've been wanting to be wanting to give it to him. So we just picked up the puppy. He's a cutie pie. Narkees has got him back there. He's actually really quiet right now. <clears throat> he instantly came and gravitated Narkees. So we were pumped because when Buster was born, he gravitated Narkees. And Narkees named him Buster. So um, he was in for training. And he's doing really awesome. 
he did really well. <coughs> so he is now going to be a licensed service puppy for Casey. What do you think of your dog, Keys? I love him. He's a cutie. You okay, Buster? I got you. So we're going to head home and take him and the puppy home. He's got to feed the puppy and walk the puppy and all that. <coughs> and now I've got to go get a few things. And Jennifer's teacher did call again, said Jennifer was fussy still. So, huh. you know what? It's the hard part about this is, you know, I think a lot of it right now is just anxiety because her last big seizure she had was at school before now, for the one she had a couple of nights ago. So, she's having anxiety from that. I don't really feel bad for her because I know it's hard on her. So, I'm going to go pick her up um, out before I drop Narkies in the puppy home. So, I just picked up Skip and Shannon, and I also just now picked up Jennifer. Um, and, you guys, she was a mess when I got there. She was biting herself a little bit and smacking her face, and she's not a happy Jen. So, I just picked her up. We're heading home. She's tired. And she's hungry. She can eat some of my mouth, so I, I did give her something to eat at Chick-fil-A. And I gave her an apple juice because she loves apple juice. <clears throat> she gets most of her feet at night like Daniel does. She's a lot like Daniel that way. I took them the rest of the kids. They're doing great. Aurora was kind of fussy. I think she was getting tired, but they were going to go for breakout and nap time anyway, so that's fine. Um, as long as she's okay and not having seizures, I'm not going to worry about it. So we're heading home. Oh, God. Idiot in front of me is just like standing there like, oh, blah, blah, blah. <laughs> Not moving. His truck. Move, jerk. No. I shouldn't say stuff like that, you guys. I really shouldn't. <coughs> anyway. Oh, jeez. So I might see if DD can watch um, or that or I might just take DD with me. <coughs> And go get Shelby, I mean, Diddy and Shelby, go get some Christmas stuff. I do have a bunch of decorations that we still have from the move from Harlan that we spent last year there. And I still have a lot of the decorations from there. But I think we're going to go Christmas shopping tomorrow because the kids want to go Christmas shopping and do their, we drew names. We're going to draw names tonight and they're going to do that. Tomorrow we're going to go get that done, get some more decorations for the tree <clears throat> and get the tree up. I think we're going to put the tree up tonight, though, because there's some stuff that can go under the tree now that I've got from Amazon, so we'll see. <coughs> um, so Shannon fell asleep back there. Skippy's almost asleep, too. Jennifer's still pretty fussy, but I gave her a bottle of apple juice. I'm hoping that might calm her, because apple juice seems to. Um, we're headed home, because our kids has got to feed his puppy and walk him, so. Heading home to do that. And I've got to clean my house more. Get everything straightened out. Uh, I also got to get a good bottle of water and get something to drink because I'm thirsty. I'm a mouse dry. I'm talking so much. <laughs> Tomorrow's also grocery day. I'm not sure how we're going to fit groceries and Christmas shopping in, but hopefully we can do it. I don't know. We'll see. Uh, so, babe is. I just dropped off babe's lunch and his coffee to him. Hopefully he's okay. He looks exhausted though, but he seems okay. He's going to be heading over to the station at four. Ugh. I'm also going to bring his dinner to him because he's going to have to eat. So. so I'm going to also bring his supper over to him tonight. <clears throat> tonight we're going to make pizza because Lonzi wants pizza, so we're going to make pizza. So we're about to pull into our house. Okay. Hey guys, so I'm getting the pills packed for the week. Like I told you, I probably have to, have to do. Because there have been changes to the medications, I have to now go over all the medications and do all the changes. That makes it really difficult because it takes time. A lot of time. <clears throat> So they put words on Carnotaur at night, so I had to pack, put the Carnotaur in his nightmare. <clears throat> He's in the other room resting for a bit. I'm running to get my water. Hold on, you guys. 
I'm thirsty. I'm going to my water real quick. Oh! I almost made an airdrop happen. That would not have been pretty. Because, oh, I learned one thing. If you put one device next to another device, airdrop happened. Nothing else. Nothing else. Nothing else. I had to get some drink because I was about to have thirst and my water was in the other room. So, here's my water. <clears throat> I've been drinking CG water for an entire week now, and you guys, I love it. Best water I've ever drank in my life. I love it, love it, love it. So, um, <clears throat> BBD is helping me pack uh, Rich's meds. Uh, Rich is kind of resting in the other room. Well, I'm not really resting. He's doing some work in his office in the other room. He looks tired, though. So, he may take a nap. Knowing Rich, he might. Oh, I don't know. Ouch. Doo -doo. Um, <clears throat> we'll see. So... It's been a crazy morning so far. I'm trying to pack all these meds and everything. Dee Dee's a good help though. She's really fast. Like she knows exactly where all the meds are, what they go to, who they go to, whatever. So, uh, excuse me, that's good. <coughs> excuse me again. So because it is Christmas season, we'll buy Starbucks and get a pumpkin spice latte. Mmm, it looks good. Um, so today, I'm gonna set up a short career board. <clears throat> today, a little bit, in the shape of a Santa Claus. Um, I think the kids will like it, and I ordered a bunch of stuffy, stocking stuffers online and stuff like that. And, all kinds of stuff that we need for Christmas, which I'll show you guys when it gets here. Uh, <clears throat> We're just been getting the tree out of the, the attic so we can set it up. So we're gonna do that here in a bit. I'm stoked about it because when it comes to Christmas, I celebrate from November to January. <laughs> I do. I do. I celebrate from November to January. A lot of people don't, but I do. I love to do that. <clears throat> I love to celebrate from November to January, so. <sighs> JJ's mad. They also raised his guafazine because he was having a lot of behavior, so <clears throat> they raised his guafazine. Yeah. Yeah. So it's going for Spectre resting, taking a nap. She had a little bit of lunch. <clears throat> And I gave her a bit of a feed and she went and lay down and took a nap, so. She's just kind of not having a good day. She's a lot of, a lot of hangs there at the end. She's not happy. <clears throat> I had to go to the pharmacy and get a bunch of meds, too. Yeah, it's hard when you have a child who, you know, has so many problems going on. You think they're okay and they're not. <clears throat> Sharon and Skip are laying down for naps. They're, they're going to share them. So they're laying down for naps too. Fed them lunch and put them down for naps. <coughs> so yeah. It's fine. It's the way it is. It's life. <coughs> oh, excuse me. It is life. We do what we have to. So they also put Daniel in Carnotaur because it helps the seizure meds that he already takes. He also takes Vicapa and uh, Epidiolex now. Which is also on Epidiolex because it seems to calm the seizures and stop them quickly. 
<clears throat> so we're gonna try to get this to calm down a little bit. <clears throat> so yeah, just like our kids and doing our meds routine that we do every week <clears throat> and all that. So helping to put some stuff up in the smart channel about Christmas decoration and decorating our tree because I really want to put that out there this year because the last year I didn't have the channel to put it up on. So, but I had this one, but not that one. So. This year, I really want to go all out for Christmas and do like a Yule Hog thing. <clears throat> and, um, oh my gosh, you guys, we're just uploading a Yule Hog thing. This thing this morning is so cool. Mm. Yeah, it's really awesome. Uh, <clears throat> so, hoping that. Aurora is okay. She seems like she was fine. She was happy and giggly and everything else. <clears throat> Let's go make coffee. How about that, guys? So we're going to make coffee. And you guys, I'm hoping <clears throat> that this pot will not... I hope, I hope the lid doesn't fall off this pot. Because <laughs> every time I've used this one, the lid is going... Dang! <clears throat> so here we go again, guys. We're going to try this and see how it works. <laughs> Okay, I promise you it's going to, because like I said, <coughs> this pot is uh, a little possessed, or obsessed as I say. <laughs> I'm going to get more cream of rock as He's also out of just about out of sugar, and he likes sugar in his coffee. Rich just came in, <coughs> wanting coffee as well, so I'm making coffee for everybody. Dee Dee went to lay down for a while. She's kind of not having the best day. She got a migraine, so she's laying down for a little while. <clears throat> that burn it. Can't get this gun out of my throat. Anyway, so she's laying down for a little nap, and I'm going to watch for their kids. I think we're just going to stay like though, because he already had a bit of a nap. So <clears throat> I think he's going to stay. We can help me with the kids. So let's see what happens, you guys. Let's see how this pot works. <laughs> I'm kind of scared actually, you guys. Uh, oh, there it goes. This thing is always a pain to get to turn on. I don't know why, but it is. <clears throat> Making Cinnabon coffee because I love Cinnabon. Now, baby is all about the butterscotch today or the crow leg, but I love Cinnabon. <clears throat> oh no, this is butterscotch. I thought it was Cinnabon, but it's butterscotch. We get the uh, Boyer's butterscotch and they have a website. Oh my god, their butterscotch coffee is the bomb. Ooh. Oh no, I think it's gonna happen again. Oh no. Uh, excuse me. So this this carrying machine is a little older than some. <clears throat> but we do love it. And love to clean it every once in a while he has to clean it. Which if you wanna see what the cleaning process is like, go check out his channel, The Blind Coffee Man. Sub to my hub. <laughs> Can check that out. Sub to him. He doesn't do many videos, but sub to him anyway. Here we go. Here comes the test. The test to see if it'll fall off again. <laughs> Wait for it. <laughs> Wait for it. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> it did. Uh, it fell off again. <laughs> it, it, it fell off again. <laughs> it fell off again. It totally fell off again, y'all. Oh my god. 
<laughs> it fell off again. <laughs> it fell off again. I can't have believe that just happened. Every time we use this puzzle, it falls off. <laughs> oh my god, every time I use this. This one just goes tink, 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 tink. <laughs> Oh, Jesus. You guys. Ugh. YouTube. Now. YouTube. Red Circle. You watch live now. It's A for Explorers. New York City Red Exploring Manhattan on Friday afternoon, the 3rd of November 2013. Oh. Anyway, guys, I tell you, it's it's funny because every time I use this pot, the lid falls off. I'm beginning to think that Lonzi purposely does that just to get me laughing because he likes my laugh, but I don't know. <laughs> oh, my God, you guys. Seriously. <sighs> so it's almost time for the kids to be home here in a little bit and I've got to get a tree going but first <sighs> coffee that was the way they sound when they when they stop like perking or whatever it's it sounds like a angry bear on steroids or something and now it's time for my favorite part of the day the stir stick This probably always makes me laugh because it sounds like a NASCAR. So it sounds like one of those NASCARs on steroids. But this one actually needs to be. Um, <clears throat> excuse me. It needs to be. Uh, it needs to put new batteries in it because it's getting low. Oh. oh. See. <laughs> it sounds like a before NASCAR steroids. <laughs> YouTube now autism speaks adulting on the spectrum. Charles Hughes on autism and aging. Shut Attachment. up, thing. There's one thing Lonzi does that I never do, like he'll he'll make it go off again after he takes it out of the cup like Ree -ree -ree -ree. I never do that because I wanna save the battery to it, but it's so funny how he does <laughs> Every time he does that. Anyway. So I'm about to make a short crew board and get the kids off the bus. Hey Pop. Yeah, Rich. I got a better idea. I got some snacks. Um uh, Ugh. Dead. YouTube. Okay, I'm, just gonna, YouTube. Nice circle. I'm just going to put some out like in different bowls. What, what, do you think that might be better? That way you don't have to make a big charcoal reward. Yeah, that'll work. Thank you, Rue. Thank you very much. No problem. I know it's been a long week for you. <clears throat> it has. Well, let's go get the kids off the bus. They're here, you guys. The ABA kids just got here, and now our special needs kids are coming in, too, at the same time. It's right, baby. Hi, Aiden, Aiden. Bodie, Bodie, Kyle, Kyle. <laughs> JJ, hi, Bubba's. Uh, aren't you guys, you ready to go in? Ready to go home? You ready to go home? Yeah, you ready, aren't you? So they're getting the kids off the bus. Apparently there was a good day today. Whoa. Apparently it was a good day today. And my device decided to go off. Didn't do what I wanted to. Okay, well, hi, good afternoon, you guys. Aiden. Hi, baby. Okay. We're going to go inside. We're going to have our snack, okay? Bye, guys. Thank you. The concern bus should be pulling up at any time as well. 
Hey guys, so <clears throat> we're putting the Christmas tree up already, and it's good to see because we've been wanting to put it up for a while. But now it's officially time to do that. Got some stuff going on in the background, you guys. Sorry about the noise. We're excited about this because we're really pumped about putting this up. I, when I decorate, I really decorate, guys. I mean, I really decorate. <coughs> because, um, I want it to look really awesome for every year. And last year, we went too much too small of a house to really decorate. Or the one we did decorate, but not as much as we were going to do this year. This year, we're really going to decorate, so. Yeah, we're going to decorate big time. Hey guys, the kids are um, playing right now, so I'm wrapping a few things I got from Amazon. <clears throat> Keys is out with his puppy and his trainer. Trainer came by and said, you know, we want to do some extra sessions with you. So they're out with his puppy. His puppy's in a jacket. <laughs> so cute. So I'm going to put the puppy, I've wrapped some things for the puppy that I got in advance. Uh, a new harness and leash. And his name tag, the other one that says, Buster, Buster Harris, and it, on the other side, it says owner, Marquis Harris, so, yay, <laughs> has that address in a little, I'm not going to show that, but it's really cute, oh my goodness, so I'm just wrapping stuff, <clears throat> we're going to sit by the fire tonight, because it is cool tonight here in Texas, so, we are going to have dinner in a minute, and we're going to sit by the fire and enjoy it, so, that's what we're going to do, you guys, we're going to do that. Hi guys, we're having dinner by the fire. It is a beautiful night for that. It's so cool and balmy and like, not only balmy, but just cool out there. It's like, it could get colder, I don't know. <clears throat> it is Texas, I doubt it's going to, but. We'll be starting nicer with it, though. So, um, Lonzi is due home soon, here in a little while. I did take him his dinner, I did eat with him, so the kids are just having dinner now. But I did eat with Lonzi. <clears throat> YouTube now, House of Hughes, a painful. So, the kids are doing good. We noticed that Skip loves to eat, so, you eating, Skippy? So, Shannon's very quiet, very reserved right now with us. I understand why. <coughs> he just wants to snuggle in his blanket and eat like that. So, I've got his blanket around him, it's cool. Um, I've got the heat turned up a little bit because it is cool outside. Not bad, but it is cool a bit, so. <coughs> I'm also, um, Getting stuff ready, ready for Lonzi when he gets home. Uh, when he gets home, he's gonna have his coffee ready and probably some food because he'll be hungry then by then too. So he'll be wanting to eat a little bit when he gets home. So gonna get that ready for him <coughs> and all that. And we're just having a great evening. We're just enjoying our time, just relaxing and. So we are, our plan is, <clears throat> we are planning to go to um, England for Thanksgiving, but we're going to be here for Christmas. But after Christmas, we're heading out to New York to do Christmas in New York and New Year's. Excited about that, really big. I'm really pumped about that. I'm ready, you guys. I'm so ready for that, but <clears throat> I want to spend Christmas morning here. Um, that's just the way I want to do it because, you know, that's a fairy tale. You know, they come down, Santa Claus came, opened a bunch of presents, and all that. Um, that's the fair tale. <laughs> so, anyways, that's what we're doing. That's what we're gonna do. Uh -uh. <clears throat> hey guys, so Lonzi's home. Winds are blowing out there, so our chimes are blowing. Anyway, so Lonzi's getting his. Um, drink. We're just sitting here relaxing by the fire. It is a cool night. The kids are in bed. Sorry they didn't get to say good night to you guys. I know usually you love to hear them say good night. And usually we do that. But tonight we were just we were just done. <laughs> we were ready for the kids to go to bed because it was late. Um, they would not go to bed till daddy got home. And they wanted to snuggle with daddy. <clears throat> Jennifer especially is still not wanting to go to sleep. She wants to snuggle with daddy. So um, we're letting that happen. She's over here struggling with daddy, so. That's fine. We understand. So, we're gonna go Christmas shopping tomorrow and all that. 
our tree is up. We have two trees. We have one in the den and one in the living room. We also have one in Rich's office and one in Lonzie's office and one in mine. So we have technically like five or six trees, but <clears throat> um, Rich and Didi are over there, over there having their drinks. <clears throat> they drink a little fancier than we do. We don't, we just want some tea or something like that, but they like uh, the fancy stuff, you know. So we're just enjoying sitting by the fire and having our cups of tea. Alonzi well, has coffee and me and my tea, so. Mm -hmm. Jennifer has a cup of tea too, don't you? Yeah, I know you're tired. You want your dad to just snuggle. But <clears throat> Jennifer's drinking Cambric tea, which is like tea with a little bit of milk in it. Because, you know, it's, that way it's not so strong and not so caffeinated for her when she goes to go to bed. So we're enjoying that. And, um,. All that. So tomorrow we're gonna go do some Christmas shopping and create some more Christmas memories. And um, Rich really wants to go to this one store. It's all Christmassy. So we're gonna do that. <clears throat> and we're gonna take the kids on a carriage ride because they want to go on a carriage ride. Um, Santa Claus is gonna be there. They're gonna go see Santa. Looks <laughs> so excited. So anyway. I'm going to say goodnight, guys. I love you guys so much. I'll say goodnight. I'll talk to you guys tomorrow. Hope you have an amazing night, amazing day, and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye, bye.